everyone. Our topic for today is performing the different types of logical operators. Let us familiarize ourselves first with the different logical operators. We have here the symbol, the formal name, and translation. This one is negation. This is read as not P. It can also be translated as it is not the case as P. Or it can be it is false that P. Or it can be translated as it is not true that P. Next is the conjunction. This one is the symbol P and Q. It can be translated as P and Q. P is still Q. P moreover Q. P also Q. P yet Q. P but Q. P however Q. Take note that this one can be translated also. The symbol can be translated also as yet and but. Now for this junction, we have this symbol. P or Q. P and less Q. These are the two translations. So for the fourth one, we have conditional. This one is the symbol. If P, then Q. Or it can be translated as P implies Q. Or P only Q. Q if P. So those are the translations of this symbol. For the fifth one, we have the biconditional. You have this symbol, and this can be translated as P if and only if Q. Okay, and then P if and only if Q. And then P is equivalent to Q. For the proper use of groupings, Number one, both Q or P and R. So meaning this two are enclosed in parentheses and then and R. For the number, the second number, we have P or both Q and R. This one is the symbol for or and then these two are enclosed in parentheses, Q and R. For number three, either P and Q or R. So either P and Q, these two are enclosed in parentheses and then or R. That is or R. Number four, P and either Q or R. This one is and, so therefore you use the symbol. And then either Q or R, that is Q or R. Number five, neither P nor Q. Not either P or Q, both P or Q are not the same translation. This one is the translation or the symbol. So not P or Q. Q, or it can be neither P nor Q, not either P or Q, both P or Q are not. For number six, you have P and Q are not both. Are not both, so meaning to say this one is the negation and then P or Q. P and, P and rather, P and Q are not both, not both. Negation and that one is the symbol. And then for number seven, P and Q are both not. Okay. Take note of this. This one are not both. This one, P and Q are both not. If both not, that is not P and not Q. Example one, eating junk food is not good for your health and it is the cause of obesity in many children. So number one, you have to look at this logical operators. And this logical operator is N. So therefore, you can write it as P and Q. There is only one logical operator. So number two, if Carlos taught in his lessons well, then he is likely the student who scored highest in the Gen Math test. So take note, we have here if then. So this one is if, the first statement, and then the second statement then, that will be implies you. So this one is the symbol. Remember that this one is the symbol for and, and this one is the symbol for if then. Number three, either Filipinos are hospitable or they are generous. So we have here 
the connector, the logical operator, or. So, if we are going to translate this into symbols, this will be P or Q because of this. Number four, when preparing for exams, students need to have good focus on their lessons or they spend a lot of time reviewing but with little ideas retained in their mind. So, how are we going to translate that? So, we can translate this as P, that is, or Q, and then but. So, meaning, if we are going to analyze it, this one should be enclosed in parentheses. This is P or Q, but. This one is the same as N for the symbol. Example number five. Ginebra wins its first game or Alaska loses it. So, or. This one is we lose. So, therefore, if we will translate it, that would be P and then or not Q. Wins, lose. Number six. If Alaska wins its first game, then either Ginebra or Talk in Text wins. So, how are we going to translate that? So, P, take note, this one is if then, so therefore then. And then either Ginebra or Talk in Text wins. So, meaning we need to enclose this in parentheses. This is Q and then or R. Okay. Number seven. If Ginebra wins its first game, then not both Alaska and Talk and Text do not win their first game. So this is if then again, if, and then this symbol, then, and then not both and Talk and Text, Alaska and Talk and Text. So Alaska and Talk and Text. Okay. And for number eight, if Alaska wins its first game, then Ginebra does not win its first game. But if Ginebra does not win its first game, then Talk and Text wins its first game. There are four propositional, sub-propositional variables here. We have if then, and then we have if and then again. Okay, so if Alaska wins its first game, P, then Ginebra does not win its first game. So not Q, in close in parentheses. But, but, you know that but is translated like this. If Ginebra does not win its first game, so does not win its first game, not R, then talk and text wins its first game. Then talk and text wins its first game. So that's how you translate.